Tim Hawkinson's Bodycon exhibit has arrived to UT. Some of his most famous sculptures throughout his career are showcased at the R.K. Bailey Art Studio. Francesca Bacci, a professor of art history, is the woman responsible for bringing this world-renowned artist. This exhibition features Tim Hawkinson. He's an artist from California who works a lot on the um, idea of the body and the awareness of being in a human body as his main theme, which is why we titled it Bodycon. Tim's artwork is inspired by body awareness and most of the materials he uses are common bought items. During his visit, he was able to meet with some art students. Junior, Jody Minnis, was one of the lucky few. I was one of the students allowed to uh, actually have a one-on-one -on -one, uh, tour through the gallery with him, and he went through the work and he explained in depth some of the concept, concepts and processes that went into creating the work. Senior John Grunary was a bit intimidated at first when working with Tim. Well, um, when we first heard that Tim was coming, it was pretty exciting. Um, I had previously learned about Tim through my contemporary art class, uh, my art history class, and it was a little intimidating when I first heard that he was coming here and he you know, wanted to interact with the student population. Apart from sharing some of his wisdom, Tim started working on the concept of a new sculpture with the students, where he even gave a helping hand. And then we came up with a few designs, we came up about with 10 designs uh, total, and we settled on this, which is a mock-up actually of what's going to be the final product. So we wanted to incorporate something that related to this uh, exhibition for Mr. Hawkinson is called Bodycon, and that has to do with how he views his body, how other people view his body. Tim's exhibit isn't complete without its main attraction, the gimbaled climb basket. Professor Bacci gives us a closer look at this piece. This is a, a showstopper, if I might say so. It's beautiful, uh, three-dimensional rotating sculpture, motorized by the artist. Um, it's a gimbal because it has two forms of motion, so it rotates onto its axis and then it rotates uh, counterclockwise, hanging from the ceiling. The artist made this by taking apart a bamboo curtain and reconfiguring it in this spectacular shape. Uh, the shape is a clay bottle. A clay bottle is a three-dimensional figure that has an inside that then unfolds onto an outside. Um, and so that's the reason for the title, Gimbal Climb Basket. Um, I would like to have you observe how this is wired. The artist um, makes all the mechanisms by himself, even carving the wheels of this mechanism and building the um, motor, the engine to run it. And up into the ceiling, you can see that there is actually an orange cable, and if you follow it, you will see that the piece is actually wired through another artwork made by knotting up an extension cord. This is a bikini, it's a very ironic, fun piece, which actually feeds, feeds the electricity all the way to the gimbal climb basket. The Bodycon exhibit will be on display until November 3rd. Don't miss out on this one-of-a-kind art show. For The Minaret, I'm Alejandro Romero.